Good morning and welcome back to my channel. I'm Moses and this is Urban Backyard Container Garden. You're looking at uh, my chop, my top chop collar. Um, I grew it for the 2023 Indoor Grow Challenge. And as you can see, it is looking amazing. Now I'm starting to get some yellowing here. And I know the reason why uh, that I haven't put any nutrients in the uh, container or in the uh, lit pot rather. And that's because uh, as many of you know, we're uh, in the process of moving. So um, why put um, nutrients in when I'm going to remove the plant? And I'll probably be doing that sometime this week. But I just wanted to show you how good the plant looks. Um, it has, as I said in the last video, completely shaded out um, the two lettuce plants. And those are actually dead now. So um, probably sometime this week we'll be removing um, this from the container. So I can clean the container and uh, pack it away. Hey, this is my uh, tomato plant that I'm growing in deep water culture. And the plant itself, uh, as I said in the last video, looks weird to me, looks odd. Um, a lot of the uh, foliage um, had started to become rough and die. Looks similar to that. But um, as I said before, doing it this way let, lets me know that I can grow um sour plant in soil and then remove uh the soil and put it into deep water culture and grow um this plant um is not going to make any tomatoes or anything like that but um also in a couple days i will be removing it and cleaning the system so it can be uh stored away as well so I hope you enjoyed this quick little um, video, let you know what's going on with the uh, WIG 2023 Indoor Growth Challenge. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, take a moment to consider doing so. I can grow a lot of vegetables by myself, but I can't grow the channel without your help. If you do decide to subscribe, don't forget to hit the like and the notification bell all, so you'll be notified whenever I upload new content. Um, in the upcoming weeks, I will have um, several new videos coming out, and um, I think you'll enjoy all of them. You'll get to see the um, growth, the process and growth of the uh, new growing area that I'm going to have, and you'll see the ups and the downs, the good and the bad. So until next time, always remember, even in small spaces such as mine, you can grow a great amount of food for yourself and your family. Stay strong, stay blessed, and grow, grow, grow. Lastly, and most importantly, always remember to give the thanks to God. For without Him, we are nothing. Take care.